Hi, welcome to Disney to Universal. If you're new here, my name is Nicola and today's video we are looking at the Harry Potter Studio Tour official souvenir guidebook. There are two versions. You have this paperback version which costs £10 to purchase which does have a nice thick cardboard cover over the book and then you have this hardback version which costs £14.95 and so what I'm going to do just quickly at the beginning is show you a comparison of the two books to see if there's anything that's actually different and as I'm lining the two books up together as you can see the paperback version on top is a little bit smaller than the hardback version at the back. There is another difference between these two books. On the hardback version, as you can see in the light, the gold writing is, a, is definitely a better gold. It almost looks gold foil. Whereas on the softback paperback version, it's just more like a shiny reflective writing still gold but uh, in colour but the hardback version definitely has a better effect. You can also see here that the colours are just ever so slightly different and if I just turn the books over the back of the books are the same. The next thing that is different is inside of the books and it is just with regards to the end pages. So here you see the softback version opens like this whereas the hardback version has this extra page. So this is the full map you can see on here. And the pages are black in the hardback compared to the white in the softback. And as I open it, you'll be able to see the comparisons of how it should match up, but they're still slightly different. The maps are different and the sizes of the writing are different as well, so the fonts. And this part of the map in the softback is from this middle section of the full map that you can see here middle section and the hardback version is of the end section of the map which is on this side then after that both books are exactly the same for the rest of the pages until we turn to the very back of the book again and the end pages like in the beginning of the book you get this additional map in the hardback version compared to the softback version. So you turn this page over and as you can see, they are the same. So it's literally the very last end page that you get that additional map. Okay, so now on with the full flip through and I'm gonna be using the hardback version to do this.